Hello everybody and welcome to this first episode of Battle Sport Madness, the series on my channel where I am going to just be playing some Battle Sport videos. Honestly, let's just challenge somebody. Uh, I start off with a fresh rating, 1500, no battles done at all, no battles won, no battles uh, lost at all. The six Pokemon you see on screen right now are the only six Pokemon that are actually, well, you don't see anybody. That's the only six Pokemon I have that's probably um, any usable for IV breeding wise and EV training. So we face off against a Pinsir, probably, who's gonna be the Mega? Mega Blaze gonna Mega Pinsir? I'm gonna say he's bringing dual Magas like I am because both my Aerodactyl and Blaze gonna Mega and then he's got Togekiss and uh, who is he gonna bring honestly? Probably the Rotom Watch because I've got a weakness to that and Mamoshwine possibly? I'm not the most competitive battler, and predicting stuff is not my best, uh, bad, but I'm gonna go with entering the Blaziken as a lead, just because he hits pretty much anything on his team. Then I need the Greninja to take out the Blaziken if he brings it, which he probably is gonna do, because Mega Blaziken is OP. And then I am gonna go with... I don't know. Who am I gonna go with? Either Bishop, by the way you can't see the bottom screen, but I uh, might I might make a fancy layout so that you can see the bottom screen. Let me know oh, down in the description, not in the description, in the comments below what you think about that. Uh, I'm gonna go with Bishop, just because. So I'm gonna be doing two battles a video, I kinda of stole the format from Shady Penguin, but it's just really nice uh, doing two battles a video and... I was gonna say why is there a black screen, but the actual DS has a black screen, so... Okay, he's leading off with... I was gonna say Blaziken, no, that's my Blaziken. He's leading off with, what is that, what is that? Rotom Wash, that's not good, that's not good whatsoever. Um... What do we have? I have... Nothing to really hit you with. Ah, uh, Rodan Wash is a really good counter to my team, actually. Uh, what moves do you have? I already for uh, my Greninja's life opts and it's a special attacker, by the way. You have Grass Knob. That might be the best option I have. Let's switch into Greninja. Also, I might uh, not be using the actual game audio. I have to tool around a bit with what I'm going to do. I'll reflect. That's that's physical. That's physical. Good. I'm a special attacker anyways. So Grass Knot. Take it out. Play. Does Greninja outspeed the Rotom Wash? I think it does. I'm pretty sure it does. It might not. I don't know. It doesn't. Oh, it's gonna Volt Switch. That's gonna do a huge amount of damage because it's probably... I don't know. What item would a Rotom Wash? I don't know. I never really looked into Rotom Wash. I'm guessing Leftovers for some reason. I think it's pretty bulky Pokemon. Grasnot still works out really well, even better because that is a really heavy Mamoshwine there. And a super effective. That Mamoshwine is going down. Bye bye Mamoshwine. That was actually really, really uh, well played. <laughs> I mean, I didn't predict a Mamoshwine. I was like, oh yeah, I need to take out this thing. But obviously he saw the Grasnot coming. Also, Protein obviously made it so that I uh, have stab on all my moves. It's really... He's gonna protect, he's gonna protect... I knew it. Why did I not switch out? He's gonna protect, now he's gonna get his speed boost off. He's gonna see I have the extra sensory, which was kinda obvious, honestly. And speed boost, now he's gonna outspeed regardless. Can he take me? He can take me out. Because I'm on low HP. I need him for the Rotom. I need you for the Rotom, I think. Bishop really doesn't have anything to take on the Rotom with, does he? Sucker Punch, Iron Hat, Swords Dance, Pursuits. I think our very first battle is going to be a loss. If I switch into my own Blaziken, he's not Mega Evolving. Why didn't he Mega Evolve? Is he trying to... Is this his Mega? It's got to be his Mega. He, he brought the Rodan Wash. That can't be his Mega. So this has to be his Mega. But he's going to outspeed now. And if I switch into my own Blaziken... 
I'm not gonna add speed because he has to throw a speed boost up. So there's literally not a thing I can do, I don't think. Sacrificing... no. I need to extrasensory and hope he misses whatever he's gonna do. Hidden power. What kind of hidden power do you have? Oh, that's not good. But why are you not mage evolving? I don't get it. You're live orbed? Live or Blaziken? Is that a thing? Why aren't you Mega? In that case, I can just go for a Protect and Mega Evolve. No, no, I want to Mega Evolve! I suppose it doesn't matter too much. This is gonna just be... Reflect War Off, that's really important. This is gonna be just... Speed boosting until both of us are plus four. But I am Mega, so... That's really good. Let's see, I cannot outspeed probably. But I can live whatever you have uh, in store for me. Just because of the fact that I am MAGA. I'm not gonna outspeed, I don't think. High jump kick. I can live a high jump kick, right? I can live a high jump kick. I can- <gasps> I can live a high jump kick! Stone edge. Can I land a stone edge? I do land a stone edge. I might be able to- Oh, you live it! I can- I can sucker punch you. I can sucker punch you. Your blaze gun is dumb. I don't know what I'm gonna do against you and your- Oh, I'm choice. Bishop is choice. Oh, damn it. You're gonna protect. No, you're not gonna protect, so I'm gonna protect. Are you gonna protect? That'd be useless if you're gonna protect. But you're gonna get speed boost up anyway, so this is just stalling out, honestly. You're gonna go down. Wait, you're gonna go down to the live orb. Are you gonna go down to the live orb? I don't think you are. Why don't I run priority on this thing? I have Break Break Blaze Kick. I know I don't run Flare Blitz because I don't like a recoil. Stone Edge and Protect. I don't know. He's gonna add speed regardless. High Jump Kick. Miss. Please, miss. You don't miss. Are you gonna go down to the live of? That's my question. I hope you are. I don't think you... Oh, you would live with just a sliver of HP. I need to Sucker Punch. I need to sucker punch. There's not another thing I can do, but then the Rotom Wash is just gonna, well, wash me up. Can I Swords Dance? You're gonna protect. Are you? I don't know, are you gonna protect just to get speed boost off? It's not gonna matter for you, is it? I don't know, should I Swords Dance? Swords Dance is really the only option I have. If I sucker punch, the Rotom Wash is gonna kill me. And if I... Yeah, I'm gonna go with a Sword Sons. Predicting the Protect? Yes, he does use Protect, so that's good. I'm gonna go for a Sword Sons. First, I'm actually ever using a Bishop, so... I don't know if it's actually any good, but Bishop is kind of a mascot now, so... Sucker Punch. Oh! Obviously! How could I be so stupid? Sword Sons with a Choice Band! That doesn't work! Oh, damn it! What? Why? How could I be... What? Why did I think that'd be a good idea? Okay, I'm replacing Sword Zones with, uh, with a different move. There's literally not a thing I can do. How did I not think about that? Sword Zones... Choice Band, that doesn't work. That doesn't work at all. Well, the only thing I can do really is Sword Dancing. So, yeah, you can protect all you want. I can only do Sword Dances. He's like, oh no, he's setting up, he's gonna kill me. I can't, because I'm stupid. And I thought, Swords Dance, Choice Band, that's gonna work. No, obviously not. Please stop protecting, please. Just kill me. Flare Blitz, you've gotta have Flare Blitz. Or High Jump Kick, just use a High Jump Kick. It's gonna hit, because overheat. Oh, well, that works, I'm done. That wasn't good. That wasn't good whatsoever. That was really, really bad. At least I got a 1-0. Uh, 
Another 1-0, one 1-0 out, one out left. I lost a very first match. Really, how could... Swordstone's choice ban. Why? I would like another battle, yeah. I oh, know I did, that was saving my battle video. I, I'm kind of recording this already, so... Uh, I would like to continue battling, yeah, please. Uh, battle box. By the way, that routine you just saw, Shiner Routini, somebody in the stream gave it to me. Really, really nice one. Uh, that's, that's no good. That's no good whatsoever. Okay, let's not bring the bishop. Well, we can bring the bishop. Let's not sword stance with it. You have ice beam, so you're gonna come with me. Just for coverage, let's lead over to Ninja, actually. Because you can pretty much hit anything except the... Oh, Rodan Wash. Well, Greninja is going to be able to take it out, but the Kangaskhan, is, that's going to be his mega, obviously. Uh, I need to bring the blaze gun for the Kangaskhan. Then again, I could bring the Aerodactyl for... could bring both. Aerodactyl is good enough without any proper hold item anyway, and I can decide who's going to mega evolve as the battle goes along. Then again, I could bring extra drill Tyranitar for that. No, uh, extra drill obviously not for a for an Arcanine. I'm thinking who's going to take out Arcanine: Tyranitar or Aerodactyl, one or the other. Bringing two Magas. Bringing two Magas. You you know what? You're going to try and uh, earthquake me, and I have an air balloon because that's a, a VGC set I'm using. Because I was going to do double battles and then I figured, no, I'm not good at double battles. So I gave an air balloon to Tyranitar. So you're going to try and earthquake me and that's not going to work. You're going to go down horribly. Arcanine packs earthquake most of the time, doesn't it? Physical attacker, earthquake. Yeah, I think it does. You lead off with the Espeon, which kind of, uh, I don't know. You're going to switch out. I mean, that's going to be obvious. You're going to switch out. Because you know I'm a dark type. And you know I'm probably gonna have dark balls as well. That being said, what are you gonna switch out into? Something that resists it, probably. I'm just gonna go for a dark ball, see what happens. It could go for an extra sense. You go for a light screen. Okay. I don't have a defog. Oh, I really need a defogger on my team. Nobody uses screens on Battle Spot Day. You took that so well. Well, light screen half your damage, I believe. But still, you took that really well. There's literally no thing you can do against me there. You're gonna set up uh, Reflect Max, probably? Oh, Toxic. Even better. Toxic, wow. Um, not a Dark Pulse. I don't know, Green Angel looks like something that could get Guts. It can't, but... Looks like something that could get it. Wait a second, why isn't my life all broken? Is it? I don't think it was. Maybe because of the light screen, I don't know. And now you're gonna set up Reflect and you're gonna go down. So that's gonna be a nuisance to deal with. Too perfective. My life up is not working, is it? Poison? Now life of damage. Why isn't life of damage working? Is my life up? Oh, I didn't switch back to life up. It still has the speed thingy for EV training. Okay, first episode, guys. Just first episode. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna. You're gonna mega. You're gonna fake out anyway. So I have to switch out. Then I'm gonna mega. Protect. Is that a shiny one? Is it head normally that green? I think that might be a shiny one. Yeah, it's a manga. You're gonna double fake out? Yeah, it is a shiny one. So it's either hacked or it's not properly EV Brad. Or IV Brad. EV train. Probably EV train. Power up punch. That's not good. The second one is gonna do less damage there. 
So now I'm going to Maga. You can't fake out anymore. But you're at plus two. Doesn't matter because I'm gonna be at plus one speed and I'm gonna outspeed anyway. Because Mega Blaziken is pretty damn fast as it is, I believe. Uses Protect. Gonna get that speed boost off. Rock Tomb. Ah. Am I going to outspeed? It's a risk because I am not positive I will outspeed. And I honestly, I've got to admit, I do not have a damage calculator with me. Uh, opened up. So this Brick Break is gonna have to kill. Admittedly, it probably will. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I do add speed. But obviously, yeah. Still! Oh, Brick Break obviously gets rid of Reflect and Light Screen. I, I totally forgot that. Totally forgot Brick Break did that. That's why I bring Brick Break, obviously, rather than High Jump Kick, because it breaks screens. So I don't even need a defogger. Uh, so this is your last Pokemon, and at this point, my... You're not really any useful anymore, so Stone Edge... I'm gonna add speed anyway, because I'm at plus two. Stone Edge, if you hit, you're gonna take out the Dragonite. If not, weakness policy, probably. Dragon Dance. That might be slightly bad. Greninja's still alive, right? Yeah, Greninja's still alive. Speed boost. I'm not going to be able to take you out. And e Break Break and Blaze Kick are both stabbed, but they both resisted as well. So I have to Stone Edge. Hoping for a crit or really min max damage. Extreme Speed is going to take me out. It's going to take me out. Yeah. Greninja will be able to live in Extreme Speed, I hope. But let's go into Titar. Am I going to go into Titar? I'm going to... Hope that Tito will be able to do the job. I mean, you're gonna outspeed me because of the Dragon Dance anyway. And otherwise, you're gonna extreme speed. But having that Sandstorm up is gonna help a huge amount. It's gonna help a huge amount. And then Dragon Claw. I packed Dragon Claw on this thing. I totally forgot. Outrage. I'll be able to live in Outrage. Will I? Yes, I will. I live in my rage. Dragon Claw, kill it, please, kill it. Oh, I killed it. Dragon Dragon Claw killed it. Okay, one loss, one win in this first episode of Battle Sport Madness. Wow. Okay, that was nice. That was really, really nice. Close battle, kinda. I need to fix up my team a bit with hold items because that didn't make a lot of sense. You see, I still haven't perfected my team. That being said, I. Also use uh, Axe Drill and Tyranitar combination, which is supposed to be used in double battles. I only have six Pokemon. I'm going to be trying to breed some more. If you guys have uh, Brad Pokemon, which you want to give to me, obviously you can. Hit me up in the comments down below. Until the next time, do not forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Also share this video on social media if you liked it. My social media is down below in the description. Go follow me if you'd like. Until the next time, I've been Vlogger. You've been awesome. Bye.